Hi, welcome back to the Dark and Stormy Nights podcast. And we have announcements, or, well, more like, follow us on social media. We're on Twitter as the Dark Stormy K1. We're on Instagram and Twitch, known as TDSK po- underscore podcast. We're on Reddit, r slash the Dark and Stormy Nights. And we, really, we just theorize, uh, discuss, and have fun, something related to the show. You can also pitch in your ideas. We don't mind uh, hearing you guys. We'd love to hear what you guys have to say about the po- uh, the podcast or the uh, show on its own. We'd love to integrate whatever you guys have into our uh, into our you know story and stuff like that. And if you guys have any questions for us, we're on Telenim. Uh, basically, it's a QA and a uh, app, so we can always respond to your stuff. It's telenim.com slash TDSK. Um, so if you guys want to ever uh, get notifications about when we're going to be posting or when our next post is already up, you can follow us on there for faster alerts. Because sometimes YouTube, when you hit the bell, it doesn't always, you know, uh, notify you. So if you want to be notified for sure, just go on to our social medias and follow us. Uh, we're also on Spotify, Anchor, YouTube, Breaker, Google Podcast, Radio Public, and Pocket Cast. Follow us on any of there if you want to support us. If you guys want to sponsor us, go to any of our uh, uh, previously mentioned social medias. We'd be glad to uh, work with you. Thoughts? I'm drunk. He is. Uh, <laughs> Thank you for your input. You're welcome. Um... Yeah, we'd be willing, uh, uh, if you contact us uh, and want to share your ideas, we're taking all sorts of ideas, such as continuation on the story, items, characters, places, things like that. We'd love your input. Yeah, give me things to kill these idiots with. So, the sooner you help me kill them, the sooner we can end this stupid show. So, Bitch. (laughs) Schmogestein for life, man. Schmogestein. I'm right. sorry. So we killed this thing in the last episode. Killed. Banished. This is what they destroyed. This. Now I know that this is. Oops. This is technically an Ancag mini. But I painted it up and made him a monstrous demon for these guys. It looks really good. You think so? Thank yeah. You. Uh, yeah, it's very brilliant. Uh, of, of course, our model and uh, set design manager is so Loki. They did like six different colors on that guy. Taking him really. Like, yeah, even the ground is well painted. So it's brilliant. All right. So in the end, unfortunately, you forfeit treasure by sucking him into another world portal. However, as the treasure, as the portal closes up and it, it seals shut again, a note drops to the ground in front of Chris, Pick it up. and it says. What is his name? Stevius. Stevius. And it is an incantation to summon him. Properly forged. The sugar I yes, this guy's more sour than sweet, though. As we left off on our previous show, this thing tried to uh, attack Augustine and currently is thrown halfway across the battlefield. Hey, hey guys, you promised me a gold. <laughs> a voice calls from the other end of the car. Are you are you are you done with your play? Did you like the performance? <laughs> it was great. Where's my money? <laughs> Tim, keep him like a gold or something. No, cer- certainly, sir. Like a real gold. You don't want me to kill him or anything. Just give him a gold. It's fine. Okay. Very well. Um, I, I sh- thought that was just like a bad excuse to bribe him. How dumb is this guard? This. G- <sighs> Okay, just give him the gold. Uh, Augustine shouts. Here you go. On your way. On your way. Yes. You come again. <laughs> it's not. It's not safe for your legs here. <coughs> Can somebody? There's a, there's an open set. Can somebody um, help me over here? Kind of thrown forty feet. Uh, Firecrime, instead of killing me, can you go heal him? I think you might need us. I need. I, I need help up. <laughs> Good whining. I'll kill you. And then I'll walk over to him. Fuck. Ah, man, I don't know where it went. You talking about a child? I was doing a way overcast of cure wounds. Mass cure wounds? This one? No, I wasn't planning on it. What does it do? Uh, 3d8 
plus spell ability, yeah. Everybody within 60 feet. Well, yeah, if you guys want to gather around, that sounds good. You gonna drag me along, or are y'all coming over to me? Because I'm, plus I'm bonus currently on the ground. Probably, probably need a while to either uh, get up for you to help me up. Your spell casting ability. Yeah, that's what I thought. Right, so I'll go over 12. to friggin' Shaugustine or whatever your name is. No, it's currently Augustine. Augustine. 25 to everybody. Help your lazy ass Roll up. Roll a wisdom check. Or wisdom save. Oh, that music is so funny, isn't it? He was never affected by it. But yes, it's still playing. Fuck, that one. That's five. So all those memories I described in the last episode start to sow into your conscience. They start to become part of you. You can't tell the difference between this man who was, who lived a poor, humble life, who went off to war to be abused by his captains, who lived in torment, frozen in the ditches without enough food to fight for his kingdom, it becomes part of you. You're not quite sure where those memories end and where you begin. I mean, the clear difference is if I'm called, called Augustine or not. I'm, I'm 17. <laughs> I don't have that much. It doesn't mean that when certain stimuli hits you, you're not going to have a backflash or something. That never Is there any way to remove to these memories from me? Because I don't want to deal with these. I could probably remove curse, but I think that's I like, can just spell magic probably a seventh level spell. Gonna... Please do. I don't want to deal with this. There's something that takes away conditions that I probably could do at my level, but I don't remember what it's called. Blythe, thanks for helping me up. You're still a bitch. <coughs> yeah, that's what I say. That wasn't even our property, asshole! How else are you gonna stop it? You want to learn Find a way to here? turn it off? Take six damage as you're thrown onto your ass. A blue pulse of energy hits all of you. You remember those memories once again. Even me? <laughs> all of you. We're like 60 feet away from them. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I take how much? Six damage. Where's the pencil? Uncanny dodge. Three. <laughs> I don't know how I would dodge it, but three. Contribute to our Patreon if you want to give us more than one pencil to work with. Oh yeah, that would be that would be great. We'll Donate set up, today. <laughs> I haven't set one up yet. Should I? Should I set up a Patreon? I mean, people would buy. I mean, would they? We've got two listeners. <laughs> to be fair, that. every I'm just year, thousands of D and D parties suffer from not They're having enough vessels. pencils. You guys are awesome. Donate today. You can listen to just anybody. <laughs> With your help. You'll listen to us. We can help get more that it, we are just anybody at this point. Right, well, Please. Donate today, today. <laughs> or you are a very horrible we, person. We do, we, we do appreciate you guys <laughs> coming in on I us. can remove a debilitating effect. Which this should Petr count. Charmed, petrified, one curse, including the target's attunement to a curse item. Reduction of uh, ability score, one effect reducing the target's hit point maximum. Does that, any of that sound like it's in the ballpark? I was not paying attention to you. <laughs> Bruh. Well, I said you're talking to him. D and D is wonderfully non-specific, and the remove curse spell actually doesn't remove curse in D and D. It removes the forced attunement of a cursed object from a person, leaving the cursed object intact but no longer attuned to you. Yeah, right. But there is something called greater restoration, which can remove status effects. That would be the stuff that I was a wall of text that I read to you a moment ago. Yeah, you should have called my attention. Okay. If he's charmed or petrified or to a mental curse magical item, reduction of ability score, or reduction of hit point maximum. So stuff like that. Well, I know it's none of that because D&D doesn't cover him having blended memories. Yeah. <laughs> I'm when, asking when, you thinking Well, I mean, could it count because that would also fuck stuff. with my memory? No, he's just kind of like back in like, yeah, yeah so that would just like fuck with my memories. It would fuck with my mind and what I would remember. You used to have to walk uphill to school and home both ways. 
Wow, I can't believe it. They said taking the next street over, which went downhill. I'd rather not remember the memories of a coward. I'm sure we'll be fine. I think we should head back to the town for now and get a rest. May yeah. Maybe we can find. Do you find need any specific information for your summons? Uh, stat block or anything like that? I could probably just look at oh. the stuff. Yeah. Wait, would he be able to remove a demonic uh, curse on me? Because, I mean, when, cause that thing... Bargrim's got an idea. All I was going to say is, is that, again, the spell description is all three senses, but the remove curse according to this quick search um, says that it can actually cure ly ly lycanthropy. The hell does that mean? Well, no, Werewolfism. Well, Wrist infection. Well, not minor. I guess it's a substantial wrist infection. But you are not wrist infected. I am uh, slightly cursed. You are co-inhabited by the thoughts of somebody who's dead now. Um. So is there a way to remove those inhabitants? I mean, some telepathic surgery, which I don't know therapy? what spell that would be. <laughs> I just want to remove those me memories. We'll see. We'll, we'll see what happens. Chris, I, after <laughs> what just happened, yeah. I think Hail. I remember the thoughts, well not the thoughts, the memories of that coward. I do too, like all of us since I smashed No, them. it's in my memory permanently, it might have flashed you guys, but I can remember them in detail. Mm. I want these removed, I don't like somebody else's cowardice in my head. I'm not sure I'd be able to do that, but we could head to the Cervec Church tomorrow and see if they could do something. We also gotta alert them of a, a possibility of more being broken out of. The danger of the, that single demon. We've killed beholders that are prepared for everything and that was tougher. I mean, I'm sure they're was it? Was that tougher? That was way easier. What the heck? Yeah, that was not tougher. The, uh, if if we fought beholders on their own, the know, last battle you had with the beholder was four hours long. To be fair, there was also like eight other guys who kept resurrecting the That's single what beholder. It's to be prepared. It's not the beholder itself. We fought beholders itself with like way less hit points. Anyway. Uh, yes, the, uh, one of them had really. 180. I'm sure the church is well aware that there's probably multiple teams across this entire city. That's literally what your job is. Yeah. These are demonic memories, and I want them removed. That's all I'm a a asking, so... Yeah, I get that, but fucking... I don't want another vision. Those things are fucking annoying. I want ready to head back to the tavern? Yeah, yes. yeah, I'm tired. This... I hurt. Sounds good. Tavern or hotel? Like, or your hotel rooms? I guess hotel rooms. A place with a bed attached. Uh, where I can get food. <laughs> First, I'm going to turn to. Fuck, what's his name? I, I'm playing a blank. July. Jim? No, the, the Augustine. robot guy. Oh, oh. Alistair. You were calling Alistair. 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 Um, I'm going to turn to him. Uh, do you head back to the artificers now? Or? Yes, that is my home. He mm. says in the series, I can't do the voice because it sounds like a record. You know? Okay. And I'm not capable of those vocal talents. But you hear the, the hissing of, like, the needle on the track, you know? Okay. Right. Well, we'll see you around, bud. Come to me when you are ready to hunt your demons. All right. Uh, tomorrow? I don't want to risk somebody who's well, not part of our party. They come for him. Yeah. Right. Where is he going to be? The artificers. I know where it is because I've been. We we all three of us have been to his home. And Carnegie Hall. That's where. Carnegie Hall. It wasn't a pun. Okay. <laughs> My shame is faded. Continue. We were blinking. What he was, I wasn't. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. So you all exhausted slink back. Tim, of course, seems the the most energized. He did do the least. 
be fair, he went through a lot. And, and he seems to be a little quieter, kind of thinking over what happened to him. And then he does this thing where he's like looking down every street. Damn, buddy, you okay? Side street. I know she's around here somewhere. She? No. He had a victim while we were fighting. A time while he was gone. So, like 15 minutes into your walk, he stops in an alley. I think she's down here. The alley's dark. Between two businesses, some kind of restaurant and, and uh, a can I ask a question? washing wench. Three. Right, who are you asking? The party you guys want. I, I can yep. see. It there's a lot of me, trash. Me, I can see it. I understand that he thinks there's a corpse to be found in an alley. No. Yeah. I just wanted to be, to be more precise. Right. So, do you think it's best that we discover a corpse that we may then get blamed for? Let me and Tim go down at least, because I can see. that she will just rot here if nobody discovers her. But yes. It's a city. Someone's I gonna see discover your her. logic. Likely. Just go through city. We'll simply pile trash on top of her corpse. Oh, don't do that. That's just no. fucked. Tim, let's go. Yep. I have. Yep. Tim, how about this? I'll give you a friend. You'll give me a friend. I got a message. Do not. A scroll from Fire. And I'm able to summon a friend for you. The friend we just killed. Was that much of a friend? Why would you know he tried ripping my spine open, I and I'm this not. This is a different demon. But we could use the body in the alley as a vessel if we wished. Now, so it's only bloody clothed. Mm. 